The star tight end of Halaya State Championship team last fall was Damon Johans. Winning a state title was a dream come true. As KOMU8's Bradley Davis shows us, it's time for Johans to realize a new dream. Damon Johans hit the end zone eight times his senior season at Halias. He used to be focused on hitting the bottom of the net. I thought it was basketball all in ever since he was like two years old. But his middle school football coach saw a different path to the college level for Damon. He came out for football that year and I was just like blown away like who is this kid? He was the first one to tell me that uh, if I'm going to go to college for a sport it's not going to be basketball it's going to be for football. Damon says he hopes to follow in the footsteps of another Helias tight end who starred for the Crusaders just before him. Jacobs. Hale Henches, the son of Damon's head coach Chris Henches, scored six career touchdowns at Alabama and won a national title. And he inspired a young Damon Johans. I never really watched Alabama before, but um, you know, now that I saw a kid from my high school playing there, I watched every game. Hale continues to inspire Damon in the NFL. You know, that's something that I can only dream of. I feel like it's really uh, just someone to look up to. Now Damon will have his own crowd looking up to him as he joins Mizzou as a preferred walk-on. It's a big moment kind of for Jefferson City. You know, I don't remember the last time we've had a local player who's been able to go to MU and um, it gets the whole city excited. Making his hometown and his family proud. I was speechless. I had a tear in my eye because um, it means a lot also for Jeff City. And Damon can't wait to represent the capital city. Bradley Davis, KOMU8 Sports, Jefferson City. Now, Johans joins a Mizzou roster that features several Mid-Missourians and his Crusader team that not only won the state title this past season, but they also became the first Helias team to do so undefeated.